You want to support Roller March Unfiltered? Be sure to join our Bring the Funk fan club. Every dollar that you give to us supports our daily digital show. There's only one daily digital show out here that keeps it black and keep it real as Roller Martin Unfiltered. Support the Roller Martin Unfiltered daily digital show by going to rollermartinunfiltered.com. You can make this possible. Uh, you and Latash and others of Black Voters Matter, y'all have been doing the work for a very long time. Uh, you have, of course, uh, calls from the White House President Joe Biden to do more. That's what he actually said in Tulsa. Latasha, your co-founder, she tweeted this uh, earlier today. Let me get this right. Y'all want us to do more work, register more people, and turn out more voters. The last time we did that, we got attacked and now have fewer voting rights. Please explain the logic of why do we have to bear the burden to do more only to get less. Uh, again, the DNC had this particular event today at Howard University featuring Vice President Kamala Harris. Uh, but the bottom line is simple. Unless uh, President Joe Biden gets in the face of uh, Senators Christian Sienema of uh, Arizona and Joe Manchin of West Virginia, we're going to be stuck uh, with the Republicans who don't give a damn about bipart bipartisanship passing these onerous bills all across the country. Yeah, and unfortunately, it looks like uh, that, that Biden um, is basically throwing in the towel, right? They're now talking about that they want to have a campaign talking about um, I will vote. That's the, the name of the campaign Kamala Harris talked about today, Vice President Harris talked about today at Howard University. But that's putting the burden of dealing with the voter suppression on the backs of the very voters that risked our lives, literally, risked our lives in order to give them the power to deal with this. So we didn't put them in power so that they could then turn it back on us and say, well, I guess y'all got to work harder to vote. I guess you activists got to go out and work harder to organize uh, folks. Like I just tweeted out a little while ago, this this isn't uh, Bagger Vance or the Green Miles. We're not some magical Negroes that you just call up and, and ask us to work some miracles because you are unable to do your job. The White House has got to use everything that they have at their disposal including pressuring or using carrots on Manchin and Cinema. You know, a few months ago, uh, Biden was, was did a statement on one of these networks. He did an interview where he said that he would be open to modifying the filibuster. But now, all of a sudden, that's out the door. He never actually presented a proposal saying, not just am I open to it, here's my demand. Here's my proposal on how to change the filibuster. Make it happen, uh, Chuck. Make it happen, uh, Joe Manchin. He never did that. He just kind of out there acting like he's the innocent bystander in this. That's not what we need from somebody who had 40 years of Senate experience. Don't come to me or in our organizations trying to get us to solve a problem that you're supposed to have the experience and the power to deal with. And you have that power because we gave it to you. Make it happen or just be prepared for the consequences. But you can't count on us or, or ask us and demand us to just out-organize the voter suppression. That was not the, the remedy after slavery and Reconstruction to just say, oh, go out and, and, and I will vote. You know, you had to deal with systemic issues of racism and Jim Crow. And if they're not prepared to do so now, then he's not really serious about saying, as he said in his congressional speech, that he wanted to see these bills passed as soon as possible. It's time to be smart. When we control our institutions, we win. This is the most important news show on television of any racial background. Y'all put two, three, four, five, 10, 15, 20, 30 dollars on this and keep this going. What you've done, Roland, since this crisis came out in full bloom. Anybody watching this, tell your friends, go back and look at the last two weeks, especially of Roland Martin Unfiltered. I mean, hell, go back and look at the last two days. You've had sitting United States senators today, Klobuchar and Harris. Whatever you have that you have, you can bring to Roland Martin Unfiltered to support it. Please do, because this information may literally save your life. Watch Roland Martin Unfiltered daily at 6 p.m. Eastern on YouTube, Facebook, or Periscope, or go to RolandMartinUnfiltered.com. Support the Roland Martin Unfiltered Daily Digital Show by going to RolandMartinUnfiltered.com. Our goal is to get 20,000 of our fans contributing 50 bucks each for the whole year. You can make this possible. RolandMartinUnfiltered.com.